One of the biggest engagement pieces when you go live is your alerts. Having someone follow, subscribe, or anything to your channel and then that be able to be shown on your screen. Well, Studio 2 now supports that. We not only are going to be bringing you custom URL overlays, but I'm going to show you how to be able to use them in this video using Rainmaker.gg and you can use it on other platforms. So stick around and let's go ahead and take a look at custom URL overlays for Studio 2. To get started, we're going to create a new overlay to put into Studio 2 to test it and we're going to be using Rainmaker.gg. Once you've signed in, you're going to click overlay on the left side and you'll see that I've already created to here. For this example, we're going to make a new overlay. And once we click that, we'll go ahead and choose new overlay. I'm going to call this one Studio Test 2 because I've already made a few of these. The screen size needs to match the creator plan that you have. If you have a 720p creator plan, then this needs to be set to 1280 by 720. If you have a 1080p creator plan, you need to set it to 1080p. It's whatever setting you choose for your creator inside Studio 2 is the size that you need to make your overlay because you can't resize them once they're in Studio 2. Once you've chosen the right resolution, go ahead and click Create Overlay and you will go ahead and enter the editing panel. From here, we can add layers. I'll zoom in so we can see. We can add layers. I'm just gonna go ahead and put in an alert box and we can go ahead and put that wherever we want. I'm just gonna put it in the bottom right hand corner for now. But just to go ahead and show you, there are several things you can put in here. Text, videos, images. You can have triggers from things like commands in chat, things that pop up from chat. You can even put in your chat panel to make it show on screen. There's so many things that you can add from rainmaker.gg. I suggest you go check it out. This also works for other platforms like Stream Elements, so make sure you go ahead and consider what's best for you. After you have it customized the way you would like it, you can click the click to copy overlay URL down in the bottom right hand corner of the editor. And what that does is put that URL in your clipboard. Now we're gonna head back over into Studio 2 and we're gonna go to the Produce panel. At the very bottom, you'll see Add a URL Overlay. I've created a few of these already, but for now we're gonna call this one Rainmaker Test 2. And this name doesn't pop up on screen at all, it's just for your organization purposes. Once I click save, it will pop up underneath. Now I can click this and that will now be live on screen. To test it, if you have an overlay that has alerts, you can always pop over to that alert program and make it trigger. For this one, we're gonna click over to Rainmaker. We'll click test and click follow. Over on stream, you can see that it pops up. So this is a really easy way to add alerts onto your screen. And all you have to do is make sure that your screen size, your actual stage from Rainmaker or Stream Elements or wherever you get it matches your actual project resolution. If it's 1080p, make sure it matches that. If it's 720p, make sure it matches that. You cannot interact with the URL in Lightstream. So if you want to make sure you're using a website that you want to actively share, then you need to use the screen share feature, not the overlay feature. You also can only add one overlay at a time. However, you can have multiple overlays already preloaded that you can switch between at any time. There will soon be a feature called favorites where you'll be able to choose all of your favorite pieces from Studio 2 and keep it nice and neat underneath the stage, you will be able to take your custom overlays and put them there so you don't have to navigate through Studio 2 to change out your overlays. Custom URLs are a fantastic way for you to use alerts as well as other services to connect with your audience and increase engagement. For other Studio 2 guides as well as videos, click the playlist on screen now so that you can see all of the content that's built around this platform.